Artos. Artos. O Artos. O Artos. Ti estituto. Ti estituto. Tuto esti o artos. Tuto esti o artos. O aner esti arton. O aner esti arton. O aner esti ton arton. O aner es ti ton arton. O on. O on. To o on. To o on. Ti es ti tuto. Ti es ti tuto. Tuto es ti to o on. Tuto es ti to o on. E hine es ti o on. E hine es ti o on. E hine es ti to o on. E hine es ti to o on. O ichthis. O ichthys. Ti es ti tuto. Ti es ti tuto. Tuto es ti o ichthys. Tuto es ti o ichthys. O aner ichthyn es ti. O aner ichthyn es ti. Oner ton ichthin es di. Oner ton ichthin es di. Creas. Creas. Ti es di tuto. Ti es di tuto. Tuto es di to creas. Tuto es ti to creas. E hine creas es ti. E hine creas es ti. E hine to creas es ti. E hine to creas es ti. Majera. Majera. Ti es ti tuto. Ti es ti tuto. O es ti e majera. Tuto es ti e majera. Majeran eji o aner. Majeran eji o aner. Ten majeran eji o aner. Ten majeran eji o aner. Tuto es ti o artos. In this sentence, o artos is in the nominative case. O artos is the subject of the verb esti. The nominative case here. You can tell by the article O and the ending OS. On this sentence, O aner es ti ton arton. Ton arton is in the accusative case. Ton arton is the object of the verb es ti. You can tell by the endings on the article on and the noun, arton. 
Tuto esti o ichthis. O ichthis is in the nominative case because it is the subject of the verb. Again, you can tell by looking at the article o and the ending us. O aner esti ton ichthin. In this sentence, ton ichthin is in the accusative case because it is the object of the verb esti. You can tell by the endings on the article on and the noun in. Tuto esti to on. To on is in the nominative case because it is the subject of the verb. You can tell by the article to and on. In this sentence, a hine esti to on. To on is in the accusative case because it is the object of the verb esti. And notice the endings, to and on. It is the identical with the nominative case. And sometimes in Greek, you will see that there is no difference between nominative and accusative forms. Tuto esti e machera. In this sentence, a machera is in the nominative case because it is the subject of the sentence. You can tell it is in the nominative case by the article a and the ending Ah. In this sentence, oner ehi tein maheran. Tein maheran is in the accusative case because it is the object of the verb. You can tell the accusative case by the ending ain 